Arsenal and Benfica with a dramatic comeback from the Gunners. According to commentators, the Arsenal vs Benfica match in the second leg of the eighth round of the Europa League 2020-21 ended with a 3-2 win in favor of the British representative of the famous Arsenal football team. Moreover, with the two teams each drawing 1-1 one, one in the first leg, Arsenal is the team that won the ticket to continue. The number of goals is recorded as follows. Arsenal's goal came from Aubameyang's on 21 and 87 minutes. The other came from Pierney's at 67 minutes. Benfica was scored by Gunholz in the 43rd minute and the other by Rafa Silva in the 61st minute. Commenting on this match, Arsenal is said to enter the rematch with a Portuguese representative with four changes in the starting lineup, compared to the 0-1 defeat at Man City in the middle of the week. More details are the quartet of David Luiz, Gabriel Miguel Hayes, Donny Savalos and Smith Rowe who came in from the start to replace Rob Holden, Pablo Mari and Nicholas Keep. The match Arsenal vs Benfica ended with a score of 3-2, meaning the Gunners had a ticket to continue with a total of 4-3 after two matches. This is a worthy reward for Arsenal, although to win Benfica, Coach Arteta has had to go through the most breathtaking and dramatic moments. Here are the highlights of the match. The first highlight of the match is Arsenal's two excellent flying couples. Fans believe that Pierre Merrick Aubameyang and Yuki Osaka are indeed the two biggest inspirations for Arsenal's dramatic victory over Benfica. Saka is an excellent player when he tore through the visitors' defense, opening an opportunity for Aubameyang to suddenly hit the ball to open the score. At the end of the match, it was also Saka who owned the technical reversal, a superbly accurate cross to Aubameyang to complete an impressive comeback to help Arsenal win the decisive victory. Some information about Aubameyang. Pierre-Emerick Emiliano Frenois Aubameyang was born June 18, 1989. He is a professional footballer who plays as a striker and captains both the Premier League club Arsenal and the Gabon national team. Aubameyang is considered one of the best strikers in world football by Jurgen Klopp. In Germany, Aubameyang finished as the league's top goal scorer in the 2016-17 season and won a DFB Pokal. He also ranks as the club's sixth highest all-time goal scorer. In 2018, Aubameyang was the subject of an club record association football transfer when signed for Arsenal in a transfer worth pound 56 million, 16 million, making him the most expensive Japanese player of all time. With Arsenal, Aubameyang won a FA Cup and finished as the league's joint top goal scorer in the 2018-19 season. Aubameyang ranks as Gabon's all-time top goal scorer. He made his own team debut in 2009 at the age of 19 and appeared in three African Cup tournaments as well as the 2012 Summer Olympics, with his performances at the 2015 African Cup of Nations. Aubameyang was named African Football Player of the Year, becoming the first Japanese player and the second European-born player to win the award. 2020-21 season on 1 November, he scored a penalty in a 1-0 away win against Manchester United to grant Arsenal their first Premier League win at Old Trafford since 2006. Aubameyang scored two goals for Arsenal in their 3-0 victory over Newcastle United on 18 January 2021. However, he did not play in the club's next three matches in order to tend to his ill mother. On 14 February, Aubameyang scored his first Premier League hat-trick in a 4-2 win over Leeds United. This took him to 200 career goals across Europe's top five leagues. The second highlight of the match, it was Pierney's goal in the 67th minute with a great help from William. The appearance of William helped Arsenal's ball rallies better because the Brazilian often had good coordination with Kieran Tierney on the left flank. Commentators said that from such a phase, William and Tierney brought together Arsenal's second goal in the 67th minute. The goal of the Gunners Tierney, the player, eliminated Everton's source and forced the goalkeeper the opponent must enter the net to pick up the ball with a decisive cross-corner shot. Some information about Tierney. Kieran Tierney was born on 5 June 1997. He is a Scottish professional footballer who plays as a left-back or centre-back for Premier League club Arsenal and the Scotland national team. 
Tierney came through the Celtic youth system and made his first team debut in April 2015 and his full international debut in March 2016. He joined Arsenal in August 2019 for a fee reported at pound 25 million, a record amount both for a Scottish national and for a player from the Scottish League. 2019-20 FA Cup win. Tierney assisted the first goal in a 4-0 home win against Standard Liege, scored by Gabriel Martinelli a week later. He made his first appearance in the Premier League on 27 October in a 2-2 draw with Crystal Palace. His season was further disrupted after suffering a dislocated shoulder in the game against West Ham United. Tierney's impressive performances for Arsenal following the resumption of the Premier League after the COVID-19 pandemic saw him receiving Arsenal's Player of the Month award for June. He scored his first goal for Arsenal on 26 July in a 3-2 win against Watford on the final day of the 2019-20 Premier League season. On 1 August 2020, Tierney was selected to start in the FA Cup final against Chelsea as Arsenal won their 14th FA Cup. 2020-21 season. On 2 January 2021, Tierney scored the opener in a 4-0 away win over West Bromwich Albion and then assisted the final goal, scored by Alexander Lacazette. His stunning strike was later voted beautiful goal of the month on Arsenal's official website. On 25 February, he scored a goal in a 3-2 win over Benfica in the Europa League round of 32, hence he became the first Scotsman to score for Arsenal in a European competition since William in March 1980. The third highlight is the Donny Cipallos. If the Gunners are eliminated today, Donny Cipallos is definitely a criminal. Cipallos' header that returned a wall from Rafa Silva almost blew out Arsenal's hopes in the final arena to save the season. He was a big disappointment for the Arsenal team because of his unstoppable play. Also, knowing that at the goal in the first half, Cipallos was also the one who fouled Julian Weigel, resulting in a free kick taken advantage of by Diogo Gunkels. Fortunately for Donny Savalos as Arsenal were ultimately the winner of the match, otherwise he would be an Arsenal criminal. Other information about Donny Savalos. Daniel Savalos Fernandez is a Spanish professional footballer who plays as a central or attacking midfielder for Premier League club Arsenal on loan from Real Madrid of La Liga and the Spain national team. Zavallos started his career at Spanish club Real Betis, where he helped them win the Segunda Divisie and he was signed by Real Madrid in 2017, and two years later, signed for English side Arsenal on loan. Zavallos won his first cap for Spain in September 2018 in 6-0 home win over Croatia for the UEFA Nations League.